All right, guys, so we're gonna be taking the top 15 NFL team social designs and basically ranking them from S tier all the way to question mark, which is basically, you can make up what question mark means, right? It's, nothing's that bad, but we're taking the top 15 teams. And for the record, before anyone comes after me, it's bit, I looked at a random site. It looked legit. It looked like I had stats and all that good stuff. So if your team's not on here, do not come after me, okay? But I did have my editor put this PSC together. So this is all be first impressions and hopefully it's gonna be fun. Uh, just to, like kind of see how these teams go. I did see LA Rams and for the record, uh, for like design wise, how, how? Anyway, so let's get this started. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys do like these videos, leave a like on it, comment down, just something so I know you're there and then sub, okay, enjoy. All right, guys, so let's get this started. We have up first, we have the Arizona Cardinals. Okay, so this video is honestly gonna be really hard for me <laughs> to just destroy so many people's feelings. Um, okay, so take it a take it a look. All right, I, I <laughs> how much does a NFL team cost? what <laughs> okay hold on wow could you imagine spending 3.5 billion and this is what your homie will cry? it's not like terrible it's not bad okay like if i look at it, i'm giving a quick little second okay if i digest some of this stuff i think this top left one the happy birthday surprisingly the happy birthday graphic might be the best one in my opinion the best looking one um but there's just there's like what, what is whatever's happening here is there's a problem like what I, I think they even put the reflection of the <laughs> I, just, I just noticed what that is they put the reflection of the receptions on the floor like what I, I don't know ah this is gonna be so hard okay oh um you kind of like see multiple different things like multiple different kind of ideas like right you kind of have an idea of like a dark background light background dark meets like a, this bloody type of look uh, of some sort right um, you know, this is very clean, very simple, very minimal. I kind of enjoy that. This over here is not too, too terrible in my opinion at all, but it's just, it's just so underwhelming. And so for that case, we're just gonna, we're gonna put the Cardinals in the, the question mark. We're gonna, we're not gonna say what question mark is. Okay. You can make up your own mind. It can mean it's good. It can mean it's, it's not, it can mean it's dog shit. I, whatever, whichever way you want to say it. Um, that's just what, that's just what we're going with. Okay. So Baltimore Ravens is the next team that we're looking at. So if I'm giving this a little, a quick little look, okay. I'm, 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 I'm liking this actually. So I like a little bit of a different typography here, right? The, the Tucker and like the 1.7, the numbers here. Yeah. That's really cool. Sort of like folded, <sighs> folded like kind of text look and it's actually looking really really cool it's a very fun heading font and then of course you know complemented with a nice little sans serif font we got that looks good right it looks looks good right um even like the gradient work is really nicely done i think the, also the color corrections is, is not too over you know overdone but it's also very much so there i like the look overall i do think i like the designs however there are some underwhelming points in my opinion okay if we're looking at this over this tucker one over here right and like this kind of like papa john the first thing i see by the way is papa john's i don't even know but you know i feel like there could be something done here but it's like it's a cool idea it doesn't have to be always like super flashy and whatnot so this is a really cool little quick graphic realistically it's not that bad i'm just gonna say baltimore ravens they deserve a like they deserve a they deserve a b okay we're gonna say b for now we can we can tweak the t the, the the layers in a little bit but i think b is where i'm at i think that's the baltimore ravens calling me telling me they <laughs> oh, i'm about to get Ooh. i'm kidding all right, next team is gonna be the Buffalo Bills. Okay, the Buffalo Bills. I'm getting a quick look. Of, I like. I'm, okay, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I love the the sort of like color correction. You know, really fun glows going on around here. This is a. This is definitely. This took them a little bit of a. Of a I, I, English is hard. I'm. I'm flabbergasted because like anything is just good over the Cardinals at this point, <laughs> graphic design wise. Um, it's just like this looks really dope. It's like it's actually really cool glows. I love the sort of like 3D um, look to it. It's just like bas basically using like, a bevel and an emboss, which is a really good touch because their logo itself has a bit of a 3D emboss look to it too. I can appreciate that. I love that look. It's very also it's very NFL because of that kind of like you know fly in almost like you know how NFL has those flying in intros and whatnot like that 3D whatever right. It looks good. I like the look. Um, 
There are some also like sneak little elements in here where I kind of like you see the blue with a little kind of like, you know, see through background. I like those little bit of touches. Those really help bring in like that cool dope look. Um, you like little grunge tears right here. The the font choice is really nice. The hierarchy is really nice. I'm like, I'm not too flustered about it at all. Honestly, not too bad. Not too bad at all. This one right here is it's just like, why? Just hide that one real quick. But yeah, the happy birthday text too. Like it's it's really fun. I can see they're experimenting. They got someone over here who actually cares about experimenting. So I'm gonna say they deserve a whopping. Hmm. I think they deserve a good B. Like I think they I think they deserve a good B. Like a B is a, a is a pretty good term. For them i'm gonna turn there's a pretty good score for them okay so i'm gonna go with b for now again i can probably adjust it but i'm i haven't seen all these obviously yet so i'm just kind of like looking through so let's go ahead and say let's go to the Bengals, which is obviously there are in the the the, the nf I almost said something so dumb i almost said they're the world cup but don't i do i i don't i'm sorry anyway so the Bengals, right they're in the nfl the the super bowl all that good stuff so they're looking honestly they're probably looking they're looking nice okay i'm not i'm not gonna lie so i obviously the Bengals are thinking like a tiger or whatever the heck a, a bangle is is it like some kind of cat of some sort anyway they got stripes something like that right so you can think more of like a jungle um which is actually pretty cool because they have like a bit of a jungle kind of texture in the background with these little leaves i don't know if you guys noticed that but that's a dope look in my opinion right and also this kind of like uh this like i guess their bangles kind of pattern right looking really dope but even used as a bit of a stripe pattern idea to kind of put in these little elements here i love that love that love that right you can see they're actually really focusing on the idea of using actual branding elements and having that sing throughout every single piece which is something that like i don't know why the nfl kind of doesn't do much of but these guys are doing a really really good job of doing that so i like it and as well as they have like a bit of like that grungy kind of look right with a little grunge over here like grunge over here it's looking do the, the their white on white like theme is also super sexy super brilliant it's almost like 80 percent white 10 percent you know uh, orange and then like 10 percent black right it looks really 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 dope um honestly this is i don't even know where s tier should be at in this point because i'm not too sure about how these uh how these teams are lining up but for me I'm not disappointed in them. I like the look. I like it doesn't feel fast. It doesn't feel quick. They have elements that support them. So I'm going to say these guys are going to be S tier for me right now. I like I love the look. Obviously, I'm not just saying that because they're in the Super Bowl or whatever. But like, you know, they're they're looking the best so far. So I'm going to say S tier. We're looking good. The Dallas Cowboys. All right. Honestly, when I look at this, like they really they really they really did. They didn't care about that guy. I don't, whoever this guy is, they do not care about him. They're like, cut his neck off, bro. It don't even matter. Um, okay. I mean, it's not, it's not, it's not bad. Okay. There are some issues, I think, in my opinion, of using this. Like, they like, like stretch the text a little bit for whatever reason, right? There's a, there's, a, this is awkward like decision making with this designer that's doing this kind of stuff because their compositions and player like placements super dope right this is the really cool poster composition this right here goes really really hard which i'm gonna say to myself like, oh oh okay wait whoever did this did definitely did not do this <laughs> there's someone over here was like hey i'm gonna go my i'm gonna go crazy i like this a lot honestly i don't think this guy who made this definitely did not make this right because this is there's a lack of design knowledge you can tell like some dude it was like in the back like we need a graphic saying thank you like and the guy used like i don't know indesign or something i'm sorry for indesign InDesign and designers, I'm sorry, but you know, you know, or Canva, whatever. Like, what's what's the what what? Anyway, okay, it's not too great. So what I'm gonna say is it's it's not bad though, but it doesn't belong in B. So I'm gonna say the Dallas Cowboys they belong in a bit of a C area right now. That's where we're gonna put them at. Um, I, it makes sense to me because I think that's just where it, where it feels right. So let's say C for Dallas Cowboys, and uh, let's move on to the next one. All right, the Green Bay Packers, honestly, like getting a real quick, like collective look. Their colors, by the way, go so, so hard. Honestly, I think the colors even carry the designs. I'm not going to say that, actually, because honestly, the look of these, like I got a little bit of a grunge texture here, really nice, you know, subtext information here, a little bit of a 3D kind of like tweak over there, a little bit, it's very, very subtle drop shadow. I hate drop shadow personally, but very subtle drop shadow where it's not like in the way, kind of makes it look 3D, right? Even like really, really on tone color correction you can tell they have a bit of a branding element of like a a branding guide of like hey make sure our color correction is a little bit more dull have that real cool grit feeling right a little bit of grunge going on here honestly these guys are looking like 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 real good um do they deserve s tier honestly i feel like they actually might be better than the Bengals. i think i'm not sure do i like the Bengals because of the color 
or do I like the Packers because of how they actually ended up using their elements together? I'm gonna say I'm not too sure to be honest, but I do think that they they do it well here where it's not too over like overwhelming, right? But these guys have a little bit of an issue of like you know over designing, I think just a little, like a little, little, little bit. Um, not too much. So I'm gonna say to myself, okay, I think that they at least at least deserve an A tier. Um, if not, if there's like an A plus, they can be in there, but A tier for now, we're looking, they're looking pretty good. All right, so we got the Colts up next. So I'm I'm like a quick look. Oh, I really didn't. I really didn't look at these. <laughs> Ooh, what did they do to you, bro? <laughs> Honestly, what? Did, what? The, what were they thinking with this? Like, it doesn't even look good. Like, despite the fact that they want to use a gradient, it doesn't even look good. They really were just like, "Hey, we're gonna make Smurfs. And this is what it is." We're, you know. I get it. Like, no, I don't get it. I really don't get it. So why? Why are they cooking my bro? What is happening? <laughs> I'm just going to put them in cults in, in question mark, question mark. What is that? I don't like that. That was just, it's not even that great either. It's just, they, they need help. Redo, rego. Just go try again. Just try again. Wow. That was, that was hard to look at. Okay. So we got the chiefs up next and honest. Okay. I like, they have a bit of like a clipping mat, clipping mask, like a, like a sketchbook, almost like, what do you call those books that like you put things in like a scrapbook, a scrapbook look, honestly, super, super dope. And can we also appreciate the designer taking a little bit of time to pencil out these like pictures here to make it look really, really cool. That's like kind of like background border holding that this designer knows exactly what they are doing. I appreciate them. I love the designs, even like putting in the stadium here, beautiful touch, right? Like those things this is a little bit of a hard texture but i'm not gonna you know blast it too hard on it but oh even the background has a bit of like a of a you know a celebratory element of like you know a nice you know not just pure red but like a, a bit of a pattern in a way by using pictures i appreciate that right honestly honestly these guys are looking these guys are looking right they know what they're doing i'm gonna say the chiefs deserve at least an a tier if there's an a plus i think we put them in a plus as well but a tier is basically a plus at this point right so i'm liking them they look good let's go on to the next person or next team i should say which is the los angeles chargers um okay i'm not i'm not disappointed honestly i love their pattern here the charging kind of like electrical pattern. oh oh there's a bit of a half tone going thing like a half tone pattern going on as well um oh i even like how they underline things with the charger like you know lightning bolt symbol too okay not bad at all first off the colors can go a little bit harder if they tone down the bit of the grunge on the text itself in my opinion and also like a bit of this like uh, blackish tone around the yellows a little bit under like it's uh, eh, you know what i mean not too great but i love the background like gradients this like texture thing having the focus be on the actual point of interest which would be in the players themselves super dope right everything else is kind of looking okay this is a little bit underwhelming too in my opinion but i mean this this is this is dope too though okay I would say they at least, I think the Chargers at least deserve a B tier. However, I do think, given the fact that I look at, ah, uh, no, they deserve a B tier. They're, they're good. I think they're good in the B tier. Makes sense for me. Let's move to the next person, which is, or person, the team, which is the New England Patriots. Um, Okay. I feel like you can't really mess up red, white, and blue. So they're looking, they're looking all right. They're not looking like too patriotic. Like they're trying to be like a campaign of like, you know, patriot, patriotism. Nah. I don't know. Anyway, so like looking at them though, they're not, they're a bit underwhelming. Like if we're just taking a real qu uh, quick collective look, it's kind of like, eh, whatever. So for me, I'm going to say like, it's, it's really not all that. I do think they need to revisit because they can do a lot better, but it's not in question mark territory, but it's definitely like a C tier. That's where we're going to put them. And let's move on to the next person. I keep saying person <laughs> regardless team. Um, the saints. All right. Okay, it's not bad. You can definitely make this like some hard grit, like crazy stuff. They are missing the ball heavily, in my opinion, and it's just it's just kind of like text heavy as well. They, I feel like they just celebrate text too much in a weird way, or not even a good way. Sorry, but it's just like it is what it is. I think Saints for me, they're not like awful, terrible, like question mark territory, but C for sure. Let's go ahead and say where are we at now? We're at the Steelers. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I like the Steelers. I like their look. They have okay. 
honestly they have a really good way whoever's designing this kind of stuff right here have a really really clutch way of like adding so much information um even though there might be over designing in some areas where like if that you know we're talking about players um but even if you have to like imagine having to like put in 22 plus sacks four players i want you to put our logo the nfl logo i want you to put in titan record tj watt all that stuff. i'd be like D what and then again you're in a vertical format whoever this designer is honestly deserves a bit of a praise because it's honestly really hard like look at that look at that nah this is this is hard nah nah this is it i'm gonna say steelers they look good they look good to me so i'm gonna say c s tier i almost said c tier s tier for me i love that look let's go with the san francisco 49ers okay um honestly honestly i'm i'm not disappointed i was ex i wasn't expecting this but it's not bad like it's it's actually kind of cool it's they have this kind of like glittery almost like uh like it's almost like a i don't know it's just so it's like glittery i don't know it's like fun um it just feels like it's just it's just it's cool it's like mythical there's the word okay it's mythical it's kind of fun they have this it, it's i don't know what it is do i like it or not <laughs> i'm just i don't know i'm gonna say they at least deserve a c tier um that's where i'm gonna put them at let's say that all right so next though we have the buccaneers okay these guys oh these guys suck this looks like some ad from like literally literally when i was a child you can be like oh you know when you were a child you see these advertisements and you go like oh i can't wait till i'm 18 i'm gonna call and order that stuff that's this is what i get from that and i don't know about you guys but the text the breathing room is a little bit too awkward this is kind of dope right they have they have ideas they have good designers over there over, uh, honestly this composition too is actually pretty cool too but whatever's happening here like this is actually pretty cool too okay let's just take this guy out this guy out and look at this like they're they're not that bad right we're not looking that bad at all um they have okay compositions the color scheme is you know great and all that but if i'm being honest the buccaneers like the, the logo itself it has this pirate theme i don't see literally any sort of pirate theme at all so if they're even using a hashtag that's even pirate related i'm gonna be disappointed but this right here is like a really cool way to like you know throw in like a you know a scoreboard in there but how you don't have at least a bit of a pirate theme i'm not too sure i think they're missing the ball just a little bit but it's not that bad whatsoever so i'm gonna say a b tier is what they deserve and uh <clears throat> last but not least we have the titans and these guys um it's not it's not bad but like i'm looking at the background here like the little pattern thing it just basically says tennessee over and over and over again right but to me like why does it why is it like a sans serif font that to me just makes it so so awkward i would think like a more organic font more like a curvy more playful font would work out for this idea but having this be like a sans serif font and you're also your your like sans serif font being the information font it's like like eh, like why like it's kind of it's kind of awkward very 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 underwhelming and then like whatever happened here that like someone forgot to put a gradient off <laughs> like i mean <laughs> i don't know I, these guys it's not bad it's not like dog dog but it's like if there was a d tier it would be a d tier not in question mark so i'm gonna say like c tier but they don't they don't deserve to be here ah, they don't really deserve to be here I, okay they're not like they're not question mark but they don't deserve to be in c tier so i'm gonna say this is my final tier list okay this is my this is it the Bengals, and we have the steelers as s tier a tier is the packers and the chiefs those are my favorite teams graphic design wise and honestly they do a really good job at least celebrating their actual you know you know you get a bit of, of a style approach to what their team name is and also the visuals are so you know I, a lot of these teams can take a little bit of a note in my opinion so yeah i guess with that being said that is the end of the video here today and also i oh i might as well by the way throw in la rams let me just quickly throw that in for you guys so here is my la mood board which i think is like it's okay mm, mm, i might have a revamp coming up for la uh la rams just for like fun hint hint i don't know but let's just say they have like five different typographies okay like one two three four uh like literally five different typographies i can't even explain it. like what is how how also the drop shadow like they literally put this in like this this is the first time it was ever discovered by like somebody somebody out there is really enjoying that i don't even know why i just don't understand it like the background here is not bad but like over here it's kind of yeah so keep it short and sweet for you guys i think these guys deserve for me personally for a championship team going into the nfl and you guys you got designs looking like this and you probably cost like five four billion 
question mark where you are a question mark for sure so with that being said that is the end of the video here today so if you guys enjoyed the video of course don't forget to leave a like don't forget to sus uh, subscribe and like comment down maybe like who you're you know who maybe you want me to finish this off with a tier list of like your favorite other teams you know i mean this is literally a top 15 list from a random website that i just kind of trusted and went for so hopefully this is somewhat accurate and all that good stuff i think they like kind of counted the stats so Regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Since we're HQ out, now we're gonna keep smiling, stay positive, and stay freaking productive, guys. Later, much love and enjoy your day, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.